You can tell I, I didn't write this song because the guy slept for one thing. And <laughs> he dreamt and he remembered his dreams. Mm -hmm. So you can tell it wasn't me, it was Lead Belly mm. that wrote, the, wrote it. Live from the great state of confusion. It's the really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth. Heaviest podcast on the planet. Starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, Do. So sit back and get ready for your life to change forever. The secrets, miracles, and meaning of life. exciting show tonight because uh, I think the name of it is going to be, um, oh, it's very exciting because it's game day. That's what I'm supposed to say. Oh, it, it's game, game day. night. Game day. Game day, I guess is what you say. Mm -hmm. uh, and tonight's game, uh -huh. what is it? Name my book. I got I like the it. book coming out and it yeah. needs a name. Yeah. And you know what? Name my bestseller, it says. <laughs> and the first one up is the first name up might be no good. Uh huh. See how it strikes you. Yeah. 
The meaning of your life is the secret to happiness. You, yeah. The meaning of your life is the secret to happiness. Oh, yeah, yeah. Woo. No, I don't think it's any good. No good. Didn't grab me. All right. <laughs> what about this? What? Impetus. You know, because it is about the impetus of your yeah. motivation. Yeah. No good. Yeah. Well, you all can sit, write it in what you think it should be because it's what I talk about all the time, right? <laughs> yeah. You know, discover that. I mean, they're all cool names that I'm just talking about. Like, it's not grabbing me. You know? Enough said. <laughs> what do you got coming up now? Hey, we got to take a ride. We sent the limo for you. The limo's going to pull up there in about five. Three, two, one. Slide in the back there because we got to take a ride. Jimmy Joe's at the wheel and he's going to turn the radio on right away. It's old vintage old Cadillac, right? Oh, yeah. We're going out to the cornfield of dreams where the old artists come out and get us to play their songs. Yeah. They want them covered, but they want them developed. Yeah. I pass a honk at Tom. I pass a honk at Tom. I pass a county line. Pass the county line through the amber waves of grain, through those waves of grain, and past the dairy cows with their big brown eyes to the old cornfield of dreams. Cornfield, so only Molly can see the guys, yeah, right, and not just guys, girls too. Yeah, you should ask if um, Kitty Wells is in there. I could sing some Kitty Wells, yeah, tell me go get Kitty Wells and then tell me who's coming out and uh, whatever. <laughs> okay, well, I had a uh, Johnny Cash. Riding on Hank Snow's shoulders. What happened to Kitty Will? Oh, okay. Okay, we'll That's do Johnny. We're gonna, do Johnny. We're gonna do Johnny Cash and uh, Hank Snow first. Yeah. And then I'll do a little Kitty Wells after. Okay. <laughs> It'll be good. It'll be good. Okay. She's there too. John. Yeah. 1950. We're going back to 1950. I forgot to say that. Traveling. Traveling back to 1950. Well, I taught the weeping willow how to cry, cry, cry. Showed that cloud how to cover of a clear blue sky. Oh, man, you know, tears I cried, but that woman gonna flood you, big river. And I'm gonna sit right here until I die. Well, I met her accidentally in St. Paul, Minnesota. Told me up every time I'd heard that draw, southern draw. Oh, man, you took my dream back downstream to Vorton, Davenport. And then I followed you, big river, when you called. Followed you, big river, when you called. Yeah, well, he took me to St. Louis later on down the river. Greta said she's been here, boy, but she's gone, boy, she's gone. Well, I found her trail in Memphis. She just walked up the block. She raised a few eyebrows. She went down home. Johnny Cash. Oh, don't you bat down my bat and rules, River Queen, roll on. Take that woman on down, down to New Orleans, down to New Orleans. Oh, man, go on. I've had enough. Done my blues way down in the Gulf. I said she loves you, Big River, more than me. You big river more than me. Well, there's a big A wheeler, you know. Yeah. There's a big A wheeler. Yeah. It is a big A wheeler and she's rolling down the line. Hank Snow, 1953. Big A wheeler rolling yeah. down the line. Well, there's a big A wheeler moving down the track. I mean, true loving daddy coming back and I'm moving. I said it won't be long. It won't be long. 
You had to laugh on me and I set you free and I'm moving on. Uh, Mr. Engineer, take that throttle in hand. Throttle engineer, just the throttle. Cause it's out of the bad to see the southern land. You keep, keep moving me on. Keep moving really on. Funny. Rolling on. Keep rolling on. Oh, ease my mind. Put me there on time and keep rolling on. Well, I said someday, baby, when you've had your play, you're gonna want your daddy. Daddy gonna say, keep moving on, baby. Ah, oh, you stayed away too long. Stayed away too long. You had to laugh on me, and I said to be, and I'm moving on. We gotta do the horn. Yeah, I know. Someday, baby, when you've had your play, you're gonna want your daddy. Daddy gonna say, keep, keep moving, moving on. Keep moving on. You stayed away too long. Way, way too long. You had to laugh on me, and I said to free, and I'm moving on. You're gonna ease my mind, put me there on time, and keep rolling on. It is a biggie wheeler. It is a biggie wheel. It is a biggie wheel and she's rolling down the line. Yeah, baby. Rolling down the line, Ma. Bless you. <laughs> rolling on down that line. Hey, where's Let, Kitty Wells, Dad? Let's take a... Oh, Kitty Wells. I forgot yeah. I forgot we were at the cornfield because <laughs> I sort of grew out of my mind I because know. it is dreamlike and magical it out is, there. It is, yeah. yeah. Woo. Woo. There's a fog in the cornfield. Help. Help me. Okay. Uh, what was it? Kitty Wells. Okay. Then where's my song? I don't know if I can sing it here. I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. Well, I have no idea on the key, Ma. I, I have no idea on what the song is. Far across the blue water lives an old German's daughter by the bank of the old river Rhine. Where I loved her and left her, I'll never forget her. But she'll always be my Fraulein. You know this one? I gotta know it, not really. Fraulein, Fraulein, look down by the river oh, each night when the stars start to shine. By those same stars above you, I'll swear that I love you, and you'll always be my friend. same stars above you I'll swear that I love you and you'll always be my program yeah, you'll always be my program always be my program was a real kitty at the end because <laughs> it wasn't the right key. it was a weird key it's okay how did it sound kitty how did it sound? is kitty there sounds good joe did they get her out yeah that yeah. sounds good then she left good she's got did she think it was developed mm -hmm. she said My one they like them developed. developed you know just like me <laughs> we like them developed <laughs> 
Yes, sir, Bob. You know what? Uh, I intend to teach how to hire management to the voting public. Oh, yeah. You ever think about that? That's where the, it's well, where they really go it. wrong, right? Mm-hmm. Is in the hiring of their management. I yeah. mean, they own a huge organization. It's a corporation. The government. It's the National Taxpayers Corporation. Is what the go- yeah, I'm talking about the government. <laughs> and so, because I know something about that. How to hire management. The whole yeah. thing is is getting somebody to go in there. You know, you, yeah. you, know, You're you have man. to summon good stuff. You yeah. can't just go down to the local teacher's convention and grab a teacher to run yeah. the country. Yeah. Well, yes, you can. As <laughs> 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 or a professor. Yeah. You know, Obama was a professor. You go yeah. get a professor. And, uh, you know, um, w- the son, f- uh, mm-hmm. Georgie, yeah. Georgie Bush. Yeah. Shit, he won nothing. He wasn't anything. Uh, yeah, at well, all. He drove around to Well Wells <laughs> or something. I don't know. <laughs> no, he did actually do something. But <laughs> uh, he's good for George. a laugh. He's good for a laugh. Little Georgie Porgy. <laughs> okay, here we go. Yeah, he is kind of funny. <laughs> hey, we got to get to They run in the trees naked and stuff in California. <laughs> I heard about <laughs> Weird. We got to get to the uh, station, Dad. We're still at the cornfield. Still at the cornfield? Get well, back maybe in the I'll like it in the cornfield because maybe Betty Page comes out of the cornfield. No, she's at the station. Okay, we'll go out and see Betty out there. Okay, we gotta get out the station. Okay, we're still riding. Yep. Get back in the limo. You got out. No country road. Got everything in that limo, eh? And all the girl has told. Yep. Are hanging, hanging out, out of the window. window. Somebody sees a great big old tower, 50,000 watts, station THRT. Station THRT. Oh, station THRT. Station THRT. There for you and me. There for you and me. Brought to you by Alice's Restaurant you can and General get Store. You you want. And as his restaurant down at that. As his restaurant. We're going to go in the station, go up to the front desk and see Betty Page, and she'll give you a special tea. Betty Page. Ayahuasca. Specialty. <laughs> Downstairs. Send you down the stairs to the second daily prairie home companion. Uh-huh. What's it called? Uh, the really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth, starring Molly Griffin and her old dog, Deuce. <laughs> and there are Dr. Joe G2 coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual A stack in your mind, where the show always starts in five minutes. We don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls, so get back. Chill up and relax to the mellow sounds spin of the singing on our DJs, souls. DJs. Sometimes DJs. we spin them on our arse holes. Good. Get out of that ride. More good book here for you. Yep. Yes, sirree, boy. We never stop. The source of, the very source of your motivation, of course, is, as we all know by now, is evolution. Yes. Insured and assured. By survival yeah. and procreation. Procreation. Yeah. You know. <laughs> <laughs> and if you aren't cooperating with that impetus, yeah. you're going to be suffering. <laughs> you are, even if you don't know what I'm talking about. Yeah. You're doing it anyways. Yeah. It's about purpose and meaning and order and security and connection to uh, Mother Nature. Yeah. Tell you the whole thing right there. I know. Rewind it. <laughs> Listen to it again. <laughs> no, go on down to Pat's Rion. Yeah. Where they got a place for us down there. They got a booth for us down there where I've got the evolution connection down there. No. Yeah. And you know that's pretty well it. <laughs> you don't get it. You're shit out of luck, boy. <laughs> it's a therapy for smart people, Ma. <laughs> that's what your book should be called, Dad. <laughs> therapy for smart. Does that attract you? <laughs> Well, that make you pick it up? It's got, it catches my eye a little more, but I still might not read it. I'll give it away. I'll give it away at cost because I'm not really looking for money on the book. Call the book exactly what you're looking for. I want to get the, uh, you know, at Dear Abby going. <laughs> Big advice call. I want to apply it, too. That's yeah. what I really want to do. Yeah. I'm dying to see that. The same as I'm dying to watch her stuff on the charts going up and down, fighting yeah. it out with... Brothers Osborne. Yeah. <laughs> Woo, baby. You know what I like. I like the Chantini Lace and the Brothers Osborne. I got an idea. What was your um, what was your book title, Dad? What was the one you had? What was one of the ones you had? 
Well, I just looked down at the good book, and I'd sure like to make it like this, because you know that our, our premier's name is Horgan? Oh. And I was singing to your son the other day. I was singing, the poor old Michael Finney and the Innigan, he climbed a tree and he barked his shik- shinigan. Yeah. And off came yards of yards of skin again, poor old Michael Finney and the Innigan. Yeah. He had whiskers on his chin again. They grew out and then grew in again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and and then, uh, no, and then I went, and then I'm starting to. I didn't like him at first because he's a very m- a suck hole, right? Yeah, a very straight guy. Yeah. Um, but he's kind of funny now. Mm-hmm. I'm starting to notice that inside like that guy is kind of a funny guy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and he, he can't show it. Yeah. A lot like the news girl that I watch. Yeah. I know she's funny, and she's yeah. laughing at herself inside, and yeah. he is too. Yeah. But anyways, his name is Johnny Horgan. Well, John, they call him, but I'm going to change it to Johnny. And the whole thing starts off. Poor old Johnny, hora, hora, horgan. <laughs> <laughs> is that funny or what? <laughs> that is good. He got rich and then grew poor again. Uh, yeah, well, whatever. Yeah, but whore. Yeah. <laughs> <don't> <laughs> not so good. Don't, don't miss that. Because <laughs> we need sex in the show. Yeah. Yes, we do. I mean, yeah. Because it is the heaviest <laughs> podcast on the planet, but not the most pornographic. <laughs> <laughs> Which is that what should be the we better sing a song. <laughs> Shut up, let's get going. We gotta sing. All right, what? all my exes live in Texas. What what key? G mo? or B? Apparently, we don't oh know. <laughs> rudder. I think you said G sharp. Let's go and see what happens. George, straighten it out. Straighten it out, George. All my exes live in Texas. That's pretty good. Texas is a place I dearly love to be. Oh, I said all my exes live in Texas. Texas. That's why I reside here in Old BC. That's why he resides here in Old BC. Rosanna's down in Texas, wanted me to push her broom. Sweet Eileen's in Abilene, she forgot I hung the moon. I forgot that too. And Allison's in Galveston, somehow lost her sanity. I wonder how. Temple, who now lives in Temple, got the law looking for me. Who I said, all my exes live in Texas. Texas is a place I dearly love to be. Oh, I said, all my exes live in Texas. They live in Texas. That's why I reside here in Tennessee. That's why he resides here in Tennessee. I remember that old Fraser River where I learned to swim. Brings to mind another time when o'er my welcome thing by transcendental meditation. I go there each night. I always come back to myself. Long before daylight, oh, I said all my exes live in Texas. They're living in Texas. Texas is a place I'd dearly love to be, oh, I said all my exes live in Texas. That's why I reside here in Old BC. <laughs> yeah, that's why he resides in Old Tennessee. Pull out, pull out, pull out. Just take that chance. 
minutes. <laughs> no. Are you kidding? Creativity, man. <laughs> Evolution. That's what's going on in my head at all times. Evolution. Personal health and mental health management, uh, Evcon. How about that for the name of the book? Mm -hmm. Evcon, Evolution Connection, right? That's yeah. what it's really called, right? So I was thinking, Evcon. Mm. You know, like there's something like that in military. Devcon. When it gets to that level, it's really bad. I yeah, think. yeah, yeah. I'm still trying to think of a name for your book. I thought that was the whole point of this show. The hell with that. It could take, it, it could well, take I like uh, days I was or weeks. Uh, for all the cards and letters to come in on it, okay, and go so through them all, I got to put a whole crew on it. I got an idea. You had the meaning of your life is the secret to happiness. Yes. So how about Harry Potter and the secret to happiness? <laughs> <laughs> I think that's people will read dippy, it. you little hippie. <laughs> What's the next song? I'd read it. Um, the next song is "I Ain't as Good as I Once Was." Okay. To extend the confidence and self-esteem of a mother's love and good nurturing, one needs wins in the real world as well. Mm -hmm. You know, you can't just, you gotta, you gotta, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You can't bullshit the troops. No. In other words. Yeah. And to win, you have to try. Mm -hmm. But because of the way you were nurtured, mm -hmm. you've got the courage to try. That's the main thing. Yeah. Now, after you try, you have to obsess. <laughs> if it's yeah. something hard, yeah. you have to obsess. People like to say focus, but I can tell you right now, those guys that are doing the big crap, yeah. or girls, are obsessing on it. Yeah. Lady Gaga and the whole works of it. Why did I pick her? <laughs> She's very successful. Yep. And uh, you have to obsess. And to win, mm -hmm. you have to per severe. People need to know the second part. Because yeah. that's what it's all about. Mm -hmm. That's a French word. Mm -hmm. And it means by severity. Oh. And trust me, you really want to get something. The bigger it is that you want to do, the more severe it's gonna be yeah all right that's just a little beatitude out of the uh, good book for you here tonight and now we got this song that we won't remember the words of you will though right mom we're gonna try dad we're sure gonna try and you don't know what key this is in either mom it says g dad but we can try g sharp toby keith you know he's one of the richest uh, guys from country music hell yeah Dad, you're moving. Because you know Move why? It. Come in here a little more. Okay. Yeah. You know why? Why? He's rich. Why? Burgers. Burgers. And his mom was a businesswoman, real estate. Yeah. So he had the mother's love, and then he tried, yep. and then he persevered. Yep. This is what his mom said. Uh -huh. No. This is what he said. Yeah. Not to his mom. <laughs> <laughs> Forgot what song you She said, I've seen you in here before. I said, I've been here a time or two. She said, hello, my name is Bobby Joe. Me and my twin sister, Betty Lou. We're both feeling kind of wild tonight. You're the only cowboy in this place. And if you're up for a rodeo, I'll put a big country smile on your face. I ain't as good as I once was. I got a few years on me now But there was a time Back in my prime I could really lay it down So if you want to Some love to me I got just enough I ain't as good as I want to But I'm as good one As I ever was He ain't as good as I still hang out with my best friend Dave. Uh -huh. I've known him since we were kids at school. All right, nice. Last night he had a few shots. Uh -uh. Got in a tight spot. Of course. Hustling a game of pool. Uh -oh. 
with a couple of redneck boys and one great big old biker man. I heard uh, David yell across the room, hey buddy, uh, how about a helping hand? I said, David, I ain't, ain't as good as, good as I want for. Oh my, how the years have flown. But there was a time back in my prime, I could really hold my own. So if you want to fight tonight, oh, I guess those boys don't look all that tough to me. I ain't as good as I once was, but I'm as good as one as I ever was. Used to be a hell on wings back when he was a younger man. My body says, uh, you can't do this, boy. But my pride says, oh, yes, you can. I ain't as good as I want to. And that's just the cold, hard three chords in the truth. <laughs> but I still throw a few back. Yeah. Talk a little smack. Of course. When, when I'm, I'm feeling, feeling bulletproof. So don't, don't you double dog damn me now. now. I just have to call your blood. Ain't as good as I once was, but I'm as good one as I ever was. I ain't as good as I once was, but I'm as good one as I ever was. Ain't as good as I ever good as I ain't as good as I ain't as good as I once was. Whatever. Um no, we gotta sing one nice song, Ma. One quick nice one. We can't finish with that, can we? Can we sing some nice songs? Oh, you go and get her. and okay. She's gotta get the star of the show and I'll do it. <laughs> well, on call Sally, she's Bill Sweet. She got everything old Uncle John needs a baby. I said, eh, eh, just a baby. I said, baby, we're going to have me some fun now. Yes, yeah, Uncle John, Long Tall Sally, Song Mabel coming. Duck up in the alley, oh, baby. I said, hey, 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 oh, baby. I said, ooh, ooh, ooh. I said, baby, we're going to have me some fun now. Oh, Lucille. Don't you do your things well? Oh, I said, Lucille, don't you do your things well? Let a big to you, baby, I, I love you still. Oh, he's not here. How much is that dog okay. in a window? I said, the one with the waggly tail. She got a waggly tail. I said, how much is that dog? You know, we in the old man, I do hope that doggies will see. If she's we're good, Michael Miller, and we're gonna, gonna go walking in the sunshine, sing a little sunshine song. Bobby, oh, Bobby, oh, boo, you gotta put a smile upon your face, as if nothing wrong. Bobby, oh, Bobby, oh, boo, you got to think about a good time that you had a long time ago. Think about forgetting about your worries and your woes, walking in the sun. Singing the sunshine song, you're walking in the sunshine song, you're walking in the sunshine, and singing a little sunshine song. We'll make it make it up for the dog not being here and start howling ourselves, because we are a lot like the canines in many ways, especially me with the giant empathy enough to kill a man. <laughs> I don't know how I can take it. Pack it around. You keep the cards and letters coming in, and make sure you get down to Pat's Rion and check out the Evolution Connection. Eh? Yeah. Uh, you all come back now? No. Uh, see you in the funny papers. Have yourself. Uh, no, no. Uh, keep the cards and letters coming in. And you all come back now with a down and dirty little whatever. Yeah. <laughs>